Uh, this is block two flower garden or flower basket and we'll just look at the parts that we have going here. We're going to have five three and a half inch squares of one color. Here's the five squares here. Okay, we're going to have one red three and a half inch square. The rest are all triangles. Um, if you cut two four and a half inch squares of the red or whatever color you choose, you'll then cut diagonals and then you're going to pair them up with the matching ones that are out here. Um, dark blue or the dark color, I have one, two, three, four. So that's also two four and a half, four and a quarter inch squares. Uh, cut diagonally. I have two of this one that would be one four and a quarter inch square cut diagonally and I have one two three four five of those and that would be you have to cut three four and a quarter inch squares and you'll have uh, leftovers. Now as you see I have my leftovers over here they will be incorporated in other blocks so keep your scraps so once you get all your squares put together lay them out like this and what we're going to do is what we did before we're going to sew the triangles together we're going to take right sides together and sew them with a quarter inch seam and then when we open them up, they'll be like this. And then we'll cut them down into three and a half inch squares. So you'll do that with each triangle. Then once you get all your triangles sewn together and trimmed down to three and a half inches, they should be the same size as these. Then you're going to sew your rows again, this piece to this piece then this piece to this square and this square to this square so you'll have one full row here then you'll do the same thing with the next row and then the next row and then the last row so you're going to end up with four rows sewn together then you're going to sew this row to this row and then this row to this row. So when you put them up you'll have these will be sewn together here, these two will be sewn together over here, and you'll have two halves, then we'll join the halves together. Uh, don't forget how important it is to when you put your rows together that you place your pins at the corner of the points so that you get your good um, um, block when it's put together. So anyway this is block two and it's called flower garden. It's a few more triangles than the other one but it should still especially since after the first one you've learned how to put your triangles together this one should go to bit together a little bit quicker. And Once again the colors are of your choice um, try to repeat some of the same colors that you used in the previous block, adding maybe one or two different colors.